Welcome, folks. We had the Dow Industrials finish up at 343 points. We had the NASDAQ up at 259. S&Ps are up 54. That was a gain inside the NASDAQ, folks, of 2.3%, 1.5 in the, the S&Ps, and 1.1 in the Dow Industrials. Gold, gold uh, up 2 bucks, trading at 1738 you had silver up two cents, nineteen dollars eighteen cents. Platinum up twenty three bucks at eight sixty four. Light sweet crude that caught a bit out here. It's up four bucks, one hundred and two dollars sixty eight cents. Notes and bonds, a ten year note down twenty four ticks, trading one night one eighteen oh nine. The thirty year off a full point and a half at one thirty eight oh nine. And king dollar, king dollar. Uh, Basically flat, 107.058, euro 101, yen at a, where are you, 130, come on baby, where are you? There we go, 136, and the British pound at 120 to 1 US dollar. Well, you know, when we take a look at the S&Ps, folks, uh, bottom line is that you're going to go after this swing point, you know, bottom line, we had a vacation week anyway, four day week. Um, this is going to hit the swing, and I suspect it's going to be lighter volume, but guess what? We can wait till tomorrow and see how it, ha it happens. Right now, the SPY closed up five dollars fifty nine cents. We did fifty nine million shares. You're going into eighty six. Yesterday, which was the contraction, was seventy. So watch how this works out. Tuesday, eighty one million on the way up. Wednesday, seventy million. Today, sixty nine. Fifty nine. Big contraction. NDX one hundred. What was unusual about the NDX is that the NDX did have volume yesterday. Contraction today, though, had it. Yesterday we did 63 million, today you did 53. Now the swing only has 54. Now this is really cool, folks. So because the swing only has 54 million, it should be able to blow it away in a second. And if it can't, it's telling you quite a bit. That's, what I've found is that you can find out more on the counter trend moves than actually the trend move. That's what seems to, well, in my my head case, that's what happens, okay? Um, because of the fact that you get more signals, okay? You, you get whether it's stronger, whether it's lighter. That's what it comes down to. We go to the gold contract, we take a look at gold. There was no action in gold market out here today. It was a sideways move, $2.80. The whole key overnight is gonna be this US dollar. We'll see where that baby goes. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. Kicks us off, nine o'clock in the morning. Great show, folks. Wham! Look at him, folks.